Honoring Mario Molina Mario Molina was born in Mexico City in 1943. As a child, he became interested in chemistry. With the help of his aunt Esther, a chemist, Molina was able to carry out advanced chemistry experiments in an unused bathroom of his home. Eventually, Molina would study physical chemistry at UC Berkeley, where he realized he wanted to do scientific research that would benefit society and not be used for harmful purposes. He started working under Sherwood Rowland at UC Irvine. It was through research there that Molina determined that chlorofluorocarbons, or CFCs, could destroy the ozone protecting the Earth from ultraviolet light. Molina and Roland shared what they learned about the dangers of CFCs, but they were not always taken seriously or believed. While the research showing that CFCs were damaging the ozone were published in 1947, it wasn't until the late 1980s after another group of researchers were able to document the depletion of the ozone layer over Antarctica that the problem of the diminishing ozone was taken seriously. Molina was inducted into the National Academy of Scientists in 1993 and in 1995 was awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry alongside Paul J. Crutzen and F. Sherwood Rowland for their discovery of CFCs and ozone depletion. Molina was glad to achieve his goal of using scientific research to benefit humanity. Molina was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 2013 by then-President Barack Obama for his work as a visionary chemist and environmental scientist. After his numerous awards, Molina continued to collaborate with other scientists on the problem of air pollution in rapidly growing cities. Molina passed away at the age of 77 in October of 2020. Honoring Mario Molina